this hall nicely air conditioned it's part of a large exhibition center that feels nice doesn't it Russian on the left hand side in white then Camilla Badarova up against Hiju Han of Korea for the second bronze medal match in the 63 kilo category well, you can see right away both fighters are trying to get that dominant right hand grip on the color keeping each other at distance and the Korean's got that collar grip helping her control although she's released it now but helping her to control the Russian came in for a foot sweep almost got herself off balance so Badurova came here with five previous matches while Han came here with four previous matches I remember watching some of the preliminary fights of these girls and some of them are long and hard fights oh nice foot sweep nice. Badurova is proving to be a dangerous opponent with those foot sweeps. When you watch top level judo, often you realize that the fighters have fought each other so many times. Oh, oh another nice foot score. sweep. Rosari. The Ashibarai advancing foot sweep from the Russian. As I said earlier, you got to really watch out for those techniques sweeping the foot you see in the replay boom good hand control for the rotation landing hand onto the side for the score it's all about balance and leverage isn't it you've got to get your opponent off balance so you can sweep the foot away that's right and the judokas here often fighting each other for the very first time so unless they've managed to watch some of the earlier fights it's not until they get on the map that they know what the opponent's strength is and what they have to avoid now Han really has to do everything she can to turn the table oh there's a penalty coming for the Russian for passivity now pulls it locked up with a high collar grip and drops down for to Monagi. That was going nowhere. Nice try. She misses the timing. But the roll was too stable. Locked up position. Each has a high color grip on the other. So it's a little, hard, a little bit hard to move from here. And here, the Russian coach giving him very detailed instruction. It was in the earlier fight, wasn't it, that we saw one of the fighters, a Rosari, up, only to lose it right at the end as she was thrown for a Nippon. So the Russian will have to be careful. And the Korean has just under a minute to pull something out of the hat to at least square the match. Second penalty to the Russian. Now she's really got to be careful not to throw this away. One more. And she'll be penalized. Yep, three three she does. And you're out. That's right. Yeah. 
So if Badrova is able to keep her Vazari lead for another 30 seconds, then she can win this match. And try the last minute attempt. She came in, but Badrova turns out on her to her belly. The offensive skill is important, but sometimes the uh, defensive reaction is also very important because that can frustrate your opponent if they're not able to slow. Sotogari looks a little bit in danger there, but Badarova manages to turn out from the other side. Badarova, former silver medalist in the European Under-23 Championships. And she's about to become the bronze medalist at the 30th Universiade here in Naples. Mila Badarova of Russia wins it with a Wazari. And that is Russia's second medal of 